Hello children. Today we will discuss e-business. Does anybody knows what it means? No? Okay, so I will go forward and explain it. E-business stands for electronic business. One of the first to use the term was IBM, when, in October, 1997, it launched a thematic campaign built around the term. But it does not give us much information, in terms of what eBuscience is doing and how to implement it for your business. So let's look at some examples. Today, major corporations are rethinking their businesses in terms of the Internet and its new culture and capabilities. Companies are using the web to buy parts and supplies from other companies, to collaborate on sales promotions, and to do joint research. One of the first to report sales in the millions of dollars directly from the web was Dell Computer. Doing their direct selling or retailing. I have a question. What is the difference between e-business and e-commerce for example? E-business includes more than e commacker it also includes e-service the provision of services and tasks over the internet while the e-commerce is a subset of an overall e-business. E-business involves business such processes as electronic purchasing and supply chain management, processing orders electronically, handling customer services. Can you give an example of eBusine's platform? Yes sure, it is Glibex.com, Salesforce platforms. Basically, electronic commerce, EC, is the process of buying, transferring, or exchanging products, services, and or information via computer networks, including the Internet. Next class we will speak about eBuscene spanning processes, such as customer relationship management, enterprise resource planning, document management system, human resources,